सो हेलो एवरी ओन वेलकम टू माई चैनल टूडे आई उल शो यू हाउ यू कैन डिप्लय एंड होस्ट योर ओन पार्सनल बट जिरो टू दैट इज मेड बै मी सो बिफोर वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो एट फार्ष्ट यू नीड टू अकाउंट वन इज गिट हाफ अकाउंट एंड सेकेंड वन इज हिरोको अकाउंट एंड योर व्हाट्स यू मास्ट यूज ह्वाट्सएप भार्सन टू पॉइंट ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट फोर पॉइंट सेवन फोर और जी ओके सो इफ यू यूज लेटेस्ट भार्सन वट कैनट वट उल नट बी लगड इन ओके सो यू मास्ट यूज दिस भार्सन यू कैन अल्सो यूज फाउड ह्वाट्सएप आलफा ह्वाट्सएप एक्सेट्रा भार्सन बाट यूज डोन्ट यूज लेटेस्ट भार्सन ओके सो एंड लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड एट फार्ष्ट यू हैव टू गो टू माई लिंक ओके सो लेट मी ओपन सो दिस इज ए फ्रेश गिट हाव अकाउंट एंड आई हैव टू फार्ष्ट कोट माई लिंक सो आई एम गोईंग Every link will be given you in description, so don't worry. So this is my GitHub account, and I am showing you as a visitor mode. So this is my WhatsApp bot zero two. Uh, so at first, what you have to do is at first fork it. Okay, just click on fork button and click on create fork, and it will be gone into your account. So I am going into my account and refreshing it. So here you can see zero two is added into my account. Just open it. ओके सो दे आर एट टू पॉइंट वन इज कल ब्लॉकर एंड एंडी कल ब्लॉकर ओके सो माई वॉट बाय डिफल्ट हेज कल ब्लॉकिंग सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू डिजेबल कल ब्लॉकिंग यू हैव टू फलो माई स्टेप ओके सो इफ यू इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कीप व्हाट्सएप कल ब्लॉकिंग एनेबल यू जस्ट हैव टू जस्ट डिप्लॉय इट एंड आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन डिप्लॉय वेट लेट मी शो यू फास्ट हाउ यू कैन डिप्लॉय सो यू हैव टू जस्ट चेंज द लिंक ओके just copy your github link and uh, then click on the edit button and now now change the deploy button link okay here you can see template equal to my old, old account link okay just just replace it control v okay now let me check it by clicking preview okay the link is changed now i am clicking on commit changes to save everything now Now I can directly deploy it. If I directly deploy it, it will be, it will be deploy with call blocking feature. Call blocking feature means if anyone call you in WhatsApp, bot will block that person automatically. So if you want to disable the call blocking feature, you have to follow my steps. Just you have to go to zero two, then SRC, uh, then you have to go to uh, handlers, then you have to go to call handler, and to disable call blocking, you have to delete. this two line and this line this three lines okay so i am just modifying the code okay so let me zoom it then i am just deleting this line and this line just give it a space okay now i am committing changes to save it okay done so now i have disabled my call blocking so now you can just deploy it so before deploying you need some keys okay before deploying you will need this keys okay and this five one are very easy to get so to get this five keys you have to just go to these links and create an account to get this links okay i will show you the toughest one the mongo atlas mongo db atlas key or mongo db atlas cluster okay this one is toughest so i am just copy uh, let me copy the link okay now i am pasting it and now you can see this is my <laughs> i have reached into mongodb atlas link just click on try free now here i have to put my email so for that email i will use temp mail just type on temp mail go to their website they will give you temporary email i am getting a new one wait so they have given me a new email just copy it uh, and work email they are paste it now your company name give it anything i am giving fantox okay last name gaming okay password give a password eight characters minimum just agree it and click on get started now 
now you can see they have sent a verification email in my temp mail so just go to temp mail you can see there is a email just click on it wait and click on verify email now just click on continue and your mongodb account is ready now we have to create just take create a cluster just wait for some time it will authenticate automatically okay now you can select anything it does not matter what you are selecting okay now just finish it okay so click here the free one now now select amazon aws keep it mumbai or you can select other location depending upon your country okay mine is india so i am selecting indian region mumbai so just click on create user now i have to get human verification let me do it first okay done okay now now before creating username and password i have to configure my ip for that i have to just click on add my current ip address uh now i have to change the ip now click on network access page now now click on the edit button now click on this button allow access from anywhere it will access anyone okay now just go to your uh, quick start button now we have to create a username and a password okay so username i am giving fan talks in small okay and in password i have to just i am just auto generating the security key and i am just copying the key okay now let me paste it somewhere okay i have pasted the key now just click on create user now just click click on finish and close now click on go to database that's it your cluster is being created just wait for some time to finish it will take 1 to 2 minute to create your cluster now you can see my cluster has done creating now i have to just connect my application okay just click on the connect button and now just click on connect your application button now select node js version 3.6 or later and then copy it now just close it and paste the link here now you can see there is a placeholder named password okay i have to change it with my password just copy the password and replace the placeholder okay so this is my cluster link uh, let me open my key list so these are my all keys and i am going to use my keys you don't use my keys you have to use your own keys okay so i am going to get up and just going to deploy it by directly click on the deploy button now now you can see here is the uh, the cluster link is mine so you have to give it a app name like 02 test uh, 234 okay so now the chat what you are else so, okay so the brain api is the chat what you are else so i have to paste it okay keep keep cron empty okay don't put anything in cron now genius key genius key i have to copy it and paste it now google api key just copy and paste okay my name is password okay so i have told you here you can see my name is account you have to create a my name is account and put your account my name is accounts username and password in this two field okay i am putting mine and my username is okay so mods i have to add mod so for adding mods if you want to add mods uh see how you can add mod okay so my country is india so there is a plus 91 before my phone number okay so to put in mod you have to remove the plus okay and don't give any space between numbers okay you have to remove all these spaces and if you want to add multiple numbers 
you have to use it a comma and a space okay just like that here you can see i have added multiple numbers by using a comma and a space okay so i am using the second number removing okay so i have to put the mongo url mongo url is a cluster link i have just created so i am using mine for now okay so i have put at the mongo url now now prefix prefix will be the bots prefix okay i am putting suppose slash now session session can be anything i am giving capital a capital b and last thing is tenor api key let's copy it paste it okay done now just click on okay just let me check everything okay everything is done so i am going to deploy it just click on deploy app button and you will see heroku is installing my app so it will take 10 to 11 minutes to totally install your app okay it does not depend upon your internet speed so it does not matter whether you have a good internet or a bad internet in every device it will take 10 to 11 minutes to install okay just wait for 11 minutes so after 11 minutes heroku is successfully installed my app so i just have to manage my app and after going to settings and clicking on reveal config bar i can basically change everything okay so i can also change the prefix too so uh, let me show you how to change so i am putting suppose hash and clicking on save change now i have to go to more and go to view logs so you can see my bot is started giving me qr code so i have to just copy to login so at first i have to check the station okay i have put it here capital a capital b capital c so i have to just open the app now i have to put here capital a capital b capital c now click on login and you can so show now let me come to the phone screen in my mobile device i have to go to the whatsapp my click on the link device section now i have to, let me log out the previous one now i have to click on the link device put my fingerprint now i have to just log in the code to make it work okay now you can see 02 is totally activated here so let me check it for you if i put here hash okay so you can see my bot is totally working and that's how you can deploy your own bar bot in your own personal number okay after successfully deploying the bot and installing the bot there is a last process you have to do is just go to cafe just copy Oops, let me copy cafe name now just you have to go to cafe and then now you have to just copy your bots wait uh, where is the bot? okay now you just have to copy your bots name go to cafe remove that check mark and paste name and click on give my app a cafe shot in every 30 minutes so your bot will never go to automatic sleep mode okay so that's all about it guys so that's how you can deploy successfully deploy your personal bot that is made by me 02 and if you like my project please give my project a star that will help me okay thanks for watching this video and don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel thank you